So today we'll be presenting about uh, the movie of Kingsman, The Secret Service, and our group is the group TOL, which consists of uh, me, Tan Chun Tiet, Hong Yin Ching, Hello. and Lin Jing Hong. Hello. So uh, for this uh, presentation, we have pre prepared the introduction, individual behaviors, in processes, organizational processes, as well, as well as the conclusion. So first of all, for the introduction, uh, the, this movie is an action spy comedy film, which is directed by Matthew Bond, and it was released on 13 February 2015. And currently on the IMDb, which is the Internet Movie Database, it has a 7.7 .7 rating out of 10, and it is also the 54th most popular movie. And this movie has cost over $414 million and also won multiple awards in multiple award ceremonies. So next, uh, we'll be presenting the trailer of the movie. It's freezing. Why are we walking? We just look at our keys. Oh, that's Huge IQ, great performance in the Marines, but you gave up. Drugs, petty crime. We never had a job. Who are you? Your father saved my life. Thinks it's your fair game, boys. I've had a rather emotional day, so whatever your beef with Eggsy is, and I'm sure it's well-founded, I'd appreciate it if you could just leave us in peace. You should get out of the way, Granddaddy, you'll get hurt. Manners maketh man. Do you know what that means? Then let me teach you a lesson. Are we going to stand around here all day, or are we going to fight? Sorry about that. Needed to let off a little steam. What do you see? I see potential. Kingsman is an international intelligence agency operating at the highest level of discretion. If you're prepared to adapt, you can transform into a spy. Interested? Oh, yes. You are about to embark on the most dangerous job interview in the world. We're here to test you to limit, to enhance your skills. So, uh, from the trailer shown previously, we can know that uh, the plot of the movie is basically about a Kingsman. It it's basically about a secret spy organization where the first half of the movie shows the recruitment of the uh, agents, of, shows the recruitment of the people into the uh, Kingsman organization, and the second half of the movie shows the, the Kingsman organizations trying to stop the evil mastermind's plan. So now we'll be, uh, we'll be introducing the characters in the movie. So first of all, he's the pro protagonist of Gary Xe Alvin, or also known as Xe. So he's portrayed by Karen Egerton in this movie. And in this movie, he has the background, which is the son of Michelle and Lee Alvin. And he's a stereotypical chef. However, despite being a chef, he's a highly intelligent and capable person, which is shown by his uh, past that he has won numerous awards in gymnastics and is packed as an Olympic material. And he also have a good results. However, since his mother remarried to his uh, abusive, step abusive stepfather, he, his life turned around and he got involved in drugs and theft. Even after that, he got recruited as a Royal Marine, but he also dropped out halfway as his mother doesn't want to lose him like how like how she lost his father. So now I'm going to pass to uh, Yun Xing to talk about the second protagonist. So now I'm going to introduce Harry Ha. Harry is a Kingsman agent or spy under the codename Galaha. Harry Ha is a grateful person. He is sure when Lee, Epsi's father, gave his life to protect Harry and his crew from the suicide bomber during a mission in the Middle East in the year uh, 1997. Therefore, Harry also promised Lee family that he will help his family in the future. He also treated Lee son very well, such as stopping Epsi from going astray. Harry as well had great respect for his hero courageous. For example, King's claim that Harry had not chosen a suitable candidate in Lee, ignoring his heroism in sacrificing himself for Harry by claiming that Lee was not really one of the King's men. So Harry said King was a snoop. Lastly, Harry is a proper gentleman. So I will pass to Ching Kong to talk about the next character. So I will talk about Richmond Valentine, which is the key antagonist in this movie. He was portrayed by famous American actor and producer Samuel Jackson. In this movie, he was a well-known billionaire and philanthropist. Concerned about world's environmental issues, he decided to take things into his own hands by contracting a plan to murder most of the world's people. Valentine was an incredibly personable and clever guy, a competent craftsman and a brilliant strategist. Even Xi, who would eventually become his foe, thought he was brilliant. Besides, Valentine also committed his money to save the globe from pandemics such as overpopulation and global warming. Uh, next, I will pass to CK to talk about 
the individual behaviors of key characters. For the individual behavior of key characters, we'll be starting with Gary, Ag, Amrin, or Axi. So in this uh, individual behavior, we'll be covering about the canoe, self-concept model, types of emotions, model of emotional intelligence, product theory, broad drive theory, as well as the intuitive decision making. So first of all, for the C of Kano, which is, which is the consciousness, in, the, uh, in this movie, it shows that Axi pays attention to details, as the scene shown in the right, where Axi is able to able to detect the the glass is a two-way mirror and breaks the glass which allows the kingsman candidates to pass the first test but well no other candidate notice it he, he also spends time preparing in his training which enables him to complete the task or test with good results and uh, his high, high consciousness enables him to become the top two candidate from for the kingsman selection training even though he has a poorer background than the other candidates next for the a of the no which is the agreeableness which shows that uh he cares about others and also frequently helps others. This is shown in the scene on the right, where uh, Axi and his friends were ch was chased by the police and he asked his friends to uh, run away while he deals with the police alone. Later on, when he was captured by the police into the inter interrogation room and the, the police officer asked him to write out his friend's name, but he chose to remain silent to protect his friends. And lastly, he, he also cares about his uh, family when he became a Kingsman agent he invites his mother and half sister to come live with him in his new house away from their abusive stepfather. Next, for the end of the canoe, which is the neuroticism. In this movie, uh, Axie shows low neuroticism as he is emotionally stable and deal his distress. This is shown in the scene where even after uh, Charlie although his cover in Valentine's Day, he was able to re remain calm and to face the situation by tasering Charlie and escaping from the situation. This is also shown in another scene where he was surrounded by uh, enemies in two sides, but he was also able to remain calm and escape from this situation. Next is the O for the canoe, which is the openness. And in this movie, Agri is open to trying new things, such as uh, his he, he joined the Kingsman selection training. And he is also focused in tackling new challenges while thinking of creative ideas, such as uh, in one of the tests, uh, Merlin told them that one of the uh, one of the candidates do not have a uh, do not have a parachute. Then as he thought of the idea of forming a circle and the candidates pull the pull the parachute one by one and for the person that does not have the parachute can go on the person on the right. So lastly for the E of the extra version for the panel, it shows that Axi likes to start new start conversations and enjoys meeting new people, such as uh, in the scene where he's able to talk casually with Henry even after even even when he meets Harry for the first time. And he also makes friends easily, which is shown when uh, he joins the Kingsman selection training, he's able to befriend Roxy easily. And next for the self-concept model, which consists of complexity, consistency, and clarity. So for the complexity, uh, Axie has self-perceived roles or identities, such as the son, brother, friend, and Kingsman agent. Next for the cons consistency, he's able to maintain similar compatible personality and values throughout the roles that he perceives he perceive himself with, such as the kindness, loyalty, fri friendly, and responsible. Lastly, for the clarity, is he has confidently defined and stable self content and clearly knows what he wants, as he knows that he wants to become a Kingsman agent, so he joined the Kingsman selection training. He also has the confidence when dealing with problems, such as when he was surrounded by enemies, he was able to come up with a solution and escape from the situation. Next, for the self-enhancement. In this movie, uh, Axie is able to drive, has the drive to promote a positive self-view, which is shown by his personal adjustment of mental and physical health. This is shown in the scene of the right, where uh, Axie uh, maintains a physically fit body. He also has high motivation, uh, which enables him to have more energy to do things, such as uh, stopping Valentine's plan. Next, for the self-verification, uh, Axie confirms and maintains his self-concept and also prefers feedbacks consistent with his self-concept, such as he, during the Kingsman selection training, he hangs a lot with uh, Roxy, which uh, which provides feedbacks that's consistent with his self-concept. He also does not accept contrary contradictory feedback with his self-concept, which is shown in the scene where uh, Charlie makes fun, of, makes fun of him and he defended himself in the scene. Next, for the self-evaluation of the self-concept model, which consists of the self-esteem, self-efficacy, and office of control. So for the self-esteem, Axie have a high self-esteem, which makes him less influenced by others and, able, and is able to think more logically. This is shown in the movie where he is not influenced by uh, the other Kingsman candidate, Kingsman candidate that of, often make fun of him. And next, for the self-efficacy, he maintains a can-do belief, as he believes that he can uh, become a Kingsman agent, as well as he believes that he can stop Valentine's plan, which he both did. And lastly, for the locus of control, he believes that he has control over his personal life events, as 
he's shown in the movie where he does not want to become a, be a stereotypical chef anymore and decided to join the Kingsman selection training to become a Kingsman agent in order to improve his life. Lastly, for the social self of the self-concept model, uh, Eddie is able to identify if groups he belongs or have emotional attachments such as being a Kingsman agent in the Kingsman organization. And this is this shows his minority status in the social setting and it makes him feel better about himself. Next is the types of emotions. And in this movie, Eddie shows uh, several high activation positive emotions such as enthusiastic and excited, which is shown when he, he was uh, chased by the police with his friends or when Harry showed him the arsenal of Kingsman tools. And he also showed low activation positive emotions such as calm and relaxed when he was talking with uh, talking casually with Harry at the bar or when he blends into the blends in with the high powerful with the powerful individuals in Valentine's or Valentine's Day. Next. And they also show high activation and negative emotions such as such as distress and fearful when he was uh, when his cover was blown by Charlie, as well as when he was surrounded by enemies in Valentine's Day. Lastly, he also showed low activation negative emotions such as sad or unhappy when he found that Harry was in a coma after being exposed to an explosion, or when he 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 watched Valentine King, Valentine killing Harry from the computer. And next, for the model of in, in emotional intelligence. Izzy is able to know and manage his emo own emotions well, which is shown in the scene where after Izzy witnessed Izzy witness Harry's death, he is able to manage his own emotions and went to the Kingsman Saloon to find Otto to find out the next step to in stopping Valentine's plan. And next, even after in in the in the further scene, Izzy found out that. In the further scene, Eddie found out that uh, other others found out uh, others infidelity due due to the chip implant that was chip implant on the back on on the back of his ear. Despite knowing his infidelity, actually is managed to and actually is able to manage his own emotions and does not confront Arthur immediately, which enables him to know about Valentine's true plan as well as Valentine's true plan as well as save himself by switching the uh, switching the cups. Next, Axie is able to also able to know others' emotion and manage others' emotion, which is shown in several scenes where he 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 able he is able to know Roxy's fear of heights when they they are going for one of the tests to jump off jump off from the plane, and he he is able to manage others' emotion by calming Roxy down, which uh which enables Roxy to jump down from the plane with them, as well as calming Roxy down when. They know that one of the candidates does not have a parachute. So now, uh, for the four drive trilogy, the first drive is the drive to acquire, and in this movie, actually shows it show his drive to acquire, which which is shown when he acquire and retain personal experiences. This is shown that uh when he joins the Kingsman selection training, as well as when he joins Roxy and Berlin in stopping Valentine's plan. Next is the drive to bond, and in this movie, it shows that actually form social relationship and develop mutual caring commitments. Uh. With, with others, such as his half sister, as well as he cares about his uh, friends. Next is the drive to comprehend, and in this movie, Axie shows his drive to comprehend by satisfying his, his curiosity as well as knowing and understanding himself and his environment. So he's satisfied in his curiosity when Harry showed him the uh, tools that Kingsman agent used, and he is able to know and understand himself and his environment, uh, where he selects the uh, umbrella as a tool to protect himself from the soldier's uh, bullets. Lastly is the drive to defend. This is shown where Axie protects himself physically and socially, uh, where he defends his relationship and belief systems, and this enables him to become a stronger person. So uh, in this scene, we can see that uh, Charlie makes fun of Axie and Axie defends himself. In this scene as well, Charlie makes uh, Charlie pranks Axie by uh, dumping, a water, dumping a bucket of water on him, and he wants, wants to defend himself against Charlie. And lastly is the intuitive decision making. So in this in this movie, uh, Axie shows intuitive decision making by selecting the best course of action without reasoning, which is shown in this scene, where out of all the weapons available, he selects the uh, umbrella as his weapon, and this his his selection is based on his well, well established mental notes and template that he learned from that he learned previously from Harry, and by doing so, he's able to compare what fits and does not fit in the situation and anticipate for future events, which is shown where. Uh, when he, he went back to Valentine's space and fight with the soldiers, he's able to use the uh, umbrella as a shield against the soldiers' bullets. Now I'm going to pass to Yen Ching to talk about Harry Hart. 
less the individual behavior of Harry Hart, including five factor personality model, canoid, self concept model, and intuitive decision making. Firstly, I will explain the canoid. Harry Hart showed high consciousness behavior when he investigated the date of eating match. Harry involved in a bombing incident and suffered coma in the incident, but he still spent time to prepare the next plan to find out the enemy to avoid more bombing incident when he just recovered back from the coma. Moreover, Harry Hart also paid attention to listen to detail when Mary is talking in the investigation report about enemy. Apart from that, Apart from that, Harry Hart also showed high agreeableness behavior in the movie, such as Harry Hart always caring about his teammate. For example, Harry feels sad because his teammate, the father of XC, sacrificed himself to protect Harry and his teammate's life. Therefore, Harry helped his teammate take care of his family and promised their family can use the uh, negatives to help them to solve the trouble, such as XC family problem. Next, Harry also showed neur neurotism behavior or canoe because he is always staying calm when facing challenge and suffer box. This is shot in the scene where a gang of gangsters provoke Harry and XC, but he still drink and enjoy his beer and talk with those gang gangsters pol politely. Apart from that, he also stay calm and keep fighting evident rather than lo losing his mind when his teammate was killed by enemy. In addition, in addition, Harry also always show high openness behavior because he is always open and ready for facing new challenges of his job. We also can see the behavior in the scene in which Harry always opens his mind to listen. Uh, people opinions. For example, he will consider the idea for Marine to think the planning or to fight with enemy. Moreover, Harry is also willing to uh, embrace new things, such as he bring uh, XC to Kingman organization to accept training because he is willing to train XC to be his new teammate. That's why I know this. Harry also portrayed a high uh, acceleration behavior in the movie due to the job requirement. Harry needs to contract different people, including enemy, to, to get information. Moreover, Harry is also willing to talk with the problem child, such as XC, without uh, discrimination. Come to the self concept model. Harry Hart also showed his complexity with his uh, identity. For example, he has been in the army before, but he was recruited into Kingsman after serving in the minority uh, for some time. Moreover, Harry Hart also showed his complexity because he has a lot of fake identity to exceed it complex the task. Furthermore, Harry also showed his consistency by his personality, such as kind, responsible, and loyal. Harry also showed his clarity by having a clear self concept, so he knows he is already to be a Kingsman agent and can always complete the job. Confidentiality. Next, Harry showed himself a uh, self enhancement by showing his drive to promote and protect a positive self will. This can be seen by Harry is awake, positive, and his teammates such as XC father that uh, accidentally during the mission rather than trapped in the past. After Lee, then Harry adjusts mental to keeping positive and see out the way to make up for Lee family. Moreover, Harry also showed him uh, his self verification and always maintain his self concept. For example, Harry is a person who always respects and believes his teammates. Harry was a uh, domestic when Lee and Lancelot were killed, but his boss does not respect his teammate, and Harry cannot accept his boss ignoring the uh, heroism to protect Harry. Apart from that, self extreme self efficiency and locus of control are the essential key that allow Harry Hart to show his uh, self evaluation in the movie. Harry, is self, uh, Harry has high self esteem that helps Harry can be a good Kingsman agent that always complete his task without being affected by all benefit. If an individual without high self esteem may forget his original intention, such as uh, Elden that uh, betrays the organization. Next, Harry high efficiency also allows him to believe himself can do and finish all the tasks successfully in different situations. For example, Harry failed to get useful information from the university professor and injured, but Harry still believes he can target the enemy even without recovery fully. In addition, Harry also has a high locus of control that allows Harry to control the events that influence his life. It is shown in the movie where Harry Hart is an uh, army in the British, but he chooses to be a Kingsman agent that allows him to uh, punish the bad people in the world more efficiently because some bad guys have the right and power that cause government uh, cannot deal with them. As I know this, social cell is a, a essential because it refers to how we position ourselves with others. The movie shows this where Harry always identify himself as a gentleman rather than spy, agent, or curer. Therefore, this social good status made uh, Harry awake a good attitude and polite, uh, polite when talking with people. Lastly, Harry Shaw in, uh, intuitive decision making in the movie. Intuitive decision uh, making is how people make decisions naturally without uh, conscious reasoning. In the scene when Harry saw the news about the Valentine, the intuition of Harry feel that Valentine is planning a big conspiracy. Then for Harry decide to contact Valentine to investigate him with a fake identity because Harry believed that contacting with Valentine can collect more information to find out the conspiracy of uh, Valentine. Harry decide to bring Essie to the Kingsman selection training because uh, because he thinks Essie is a good selection and believe he will overcome the challenge 
of becoming a good Kingsman agent, even now uh, as it's just a craft. Next, I will pass to Xingyang to talk the next part. So I will talk about the individual behaviors of Richmond Valentine, which including Keno, model of emotional intelligence and rational choice paradigm assumptions. So for conscious conscientiousness in Keno, Valentine showed his high conscientiousness behavior, which is shown when he was trying to give away SIM cards to everyone claiming they would offer free calls and unlimited calls and unlimited internet access. This is a solution that he spent two years finding. From here, it can show that he is high consciousness because he spends time preparing his plan. Uh, next, for agreeableness in Keno, Valentine showed his high agreeableness because he cares about others, especially his assistant, Gazelle. Uh, Valentine immensely cares about Gazelle as she was the only one who did not have an explosive device implanted inside her. Besides, Valentine also shows his high agreeableness when he's disturbed by the death of Professor Anna and his VIPs due to the explosion of the security implant. Uh, next, for neutralism in Kenno, Valentine shows his low neutralism because after knowing who's, who is King's men and how they will affect his plan, he is still very relaxed. The picture below shows that uh, Valentine still goes to the tailor shop where Harry brings Axie to make Axie's new suit. Valentine pretends that it is a coincidence. He meets them and tells Harry that his people will get in touch with Harry with his proposal very soon. Uh, next, uh, a high openness behavior can be shown in Valentine's behavior. Valentine is open to trying new things and focus on tackling new challenges where Valentine tries to solve the environmental problems that the world faces by using his way, which he spends two years for the solution. This is because Valentine realized that even though he spent billions of dollars on climate change research, lobbying years of study, but the planet is still the same. Uh, next. Uh, so finally, a uh, high extraversion is also shown by Valentine in this movie. One of the reasons is that he enjoys meeting new people. For example, Valentine shows his enthusiasm when he first meets Harry Hart, who acts as a businessman, says that he wants to donate to Valentine's foundation. Besides, Valentine also tells Harry that there are no many, not many billionaires that he does not know. So from here, we can also know that as a billionaire, Valentine has a wide social circle of friends and acquaintances acquaintances which shows that he's high extravation extravation uh, next uh, by using the model of in emotional intelligence we can know that valentine can know and manage his own emotions when he knows that harry hart is one of the agents in kingsman uh, valentine is not afraid of that and still remain calm after that he pretends to be coincidence to meet harry hart in the tailor shop when harry hart brings exe to make his custom suit after that Valentine was able to know and manage the emotions of others when his VIPs are in his face. The VIP seems unhappy and sad because after Valentine activates the system, billions of people will die. And Valentine knows their emotions and conflicts, so he comforts them by telling them that they are chosen people and the story about uh, Noah's Ark. Uh, next. Uh, finally, Valentine also shows his rational choice paradigm assumptions, which evaluate all alternatives simultaneously in this movie because when his assistant Gazelle asks her why he does not want to use a simple switch to activate his system instead of the biometric security system, Valentine tells Gazelle that he should only operate the system because it is an extremely dangerous machine. So a biometric security system is a great choice. From here, it shows that Valentine calculated all alternatives and their outcomes. This is because bad things will happen if the simple switch falls into... So now we're going to talk about the team processes in organization. So well, in the first plot, we can see that uh, Harry first meets Axie in, uh, outside of the police station as he frees him. And then they went to a bar and have a casual conversation. But then a conflict happened when uh, Harry commented on Axie's personal life. Suddenly, Rob Miller and his friends went to the bar and confronted Axie about his previous action that, uh, that Axie stole Rob Miller's car. And Rob Miller and his friends confronted Axie while ask, asking uh, Harry to leave. And Harry was originally going to leave this movie. However, one of Rod Miller's friend, one, one of Rod Miller's friend said something that triggered Harry and which turned it into a bar fight, which is uh, shown in the in the scene. Well, Axie watches the bar fight and then uh, as the as the fight ends, the bartender wanted to call the police. However, Harry used uh, one of the Kingsman tools to put the uh, to put the bartender into sleep with amnesia. He also threatens Axie not to tell the not to tell the situation to anyone. So from this first plot, we can observe the relationship conflict that happened between Axie and Harry. So at first, it, they Axie and Harry was talking casually. However, when Harry started to Harry started to make uh, comments into uh, Harry, Axie's life, Axie became offended and turned turned it into a relationship conflict and attacked. 
attack Harry's personal characteristic with strong negative emotions, such as uh, saying that uh, Harry should not judge others from his ivory towers and that Harry was born with a born with a silver spoon up his ass. Next, the conflict handling of avoiding is also observed in this uh, scene. When Rob Willis and Rob Willis and his friends confronted Axie about his Axie's previous action, Axie knows that the uh, conflict is emotionally charged and that the resolution cost is higher than the benefits because Rob, Rob Willis and his friends does not like him at all. And even if the conflict is resolved, uh, it doesn't bring anything any benefit to Axie. So Axie invited Harry to leave the bar together as a method of avoiding. Next. In broad one, Harry shows he has asset power. Asset power is like the ability to influence another by processing knowledge or skill they value. For example, Harry shows show his knowledge to persuade XZ that he can deserve a better future due to his uh, high IQ. Harry also shows his professional skill against the gangster that finds XZ to fight. Next. Coercive power is an ability to apply pun punishment. Harry Hart also shows coercive power in this block. Harry punishes the gangster that provides him with lure that over his limits. Next. In the same scene, Harry also showed persuasion, uh, impre uh, impression management, information control regarding to the type of inference. Harry showed his persuasion inference to be sure see that does not, does not waste his time on uh, meaningless things because his father saved Harry life and Harry hoped that his, uh, his son can get rid of his current life. Apart from that, Harry also persuaded the gangster that can leave Axie and him in a peace because he, don't, he does not want to make unnecessary troubles. In addition, Harry also portrayed his impression management very well in the scene. Harry is a perfect gentleman. So he is always performed information management well. For example, Harry always talk with people uh, politely, even people disrespect, disrespect him. For example, Harry is not angry and asks the gangster generally to leave them to continue the conversation between XE. Then for uh, Harry maintain his good gentleman image, and this action will also build a good image for the King's Mail organization. Lastly, Harry also showed the information control regarding the type of inference. It has been shown in the scene when the patenter wants to call the police due to the violence. But Harry used the high technology equipment to erase the potato memory. Harry also threatens Axie to keep the Kingsman agent secret. These sessions are to, for controlling the information related to the Kingsman organization. Next, I will pass to Jingyong to talk about. So, the second plot that we have chosen for the team process is the plot when Axie, Merlin, and Roxy gather to stop Valentine's plan. Uh, after that, they go to Valentine's base by using a plane. So, uh, next, this picture shows that Roxy launched to the space to blow up Valentine's satellites. And after that, Xe arrived to Valentine's base and was stopped by the Valentine's people to check whether he's bringing a weapon. The next person is controlling the computer when Xe go inside Valentine's base. And after that, uh, Roxy shoot the Valentine's satellite when he is trying to activate the system. So after that, uh, Xe goes inside Valentine's base to get the private network for Molly so that he can control over Valentine's system. And he was found by Charlie and Charlie threatened him by using a knife. So Xe ran out from the base and he was chased by the soldier. And after dealing with all the soldiers who tried to stop him, Xe go inside Valentine's base again to stop Valentine that is trying to activate the system. And finally, uh, Gazelle jumps down from the window and have a fight with Xe in order to let uh, Valentine continue to activate the system. So in this plot, Richmond Valentine shows team cohesion in the team processes with his assistant Gazelle, and this is shown that he tries to remain a smaller team size where he only brings Gazelle with him for important operations. For instance, Gazelle is the only person on the top of his base, and this is because Gazelle as a personal assistant for Valentine has frequent interactions with him. Uh, besides, uh, knowledge-based trust can also be shown in this movie where the VIPs very trust Valentine's based on confidence in Valentine's competence. So this can be shown when all the VIPs trust Valentine's plan and attended the party, including Charlie and his family. After that, uh, the best tasks for team are also present in this plot, which is shown when Valentine is in charge of activating the system while Gazelle is in charge of stopping Xe to interrupt Valentine. From here, it shows that the complex task is divisible into specialized roles because a well-structured task is easier to coordinate. And finally, uh, team size tells that smaller teams are better is also present in this movie. It is shown when Xe went into Valentine's base, Gazelle is the only person who is uh, besides Valentine. And this is because Gazelle is, the, is his personal assistant who stays along with Valentine for a long time. So it requires less process loss that leads less time to coordinate roles and resolve differences. It can be proved that when Xe tries to stop Valentine, Gazelle knows that she is responsible to tackle with Xe, while Valentine is responsible to activate the system. 
So in this plot, uh, the team cohesion of uh, the team cohesion in Axis team is also can also be observed as uh, they have high members similarity as uh, in their team, which consists of Axie, Merlin, and Roxy. They have high members similarity as they come from the Kingpin organization, and they know that they uh, they can trust each other, that they are not corrupted by them time. And they, have, they also have a small team size of three people, and the three of them also have a frequent member team interaction, as Roxy and Roxy and Axie is trained under Merlin during the Kingsman selection training. And they also have a difficult team entry, as they, the three of them only believe in each other and does not believe in uh, the other Kingsman agents, as they fear that they uh, the other agents are also corrupted by Valentine, uh, such as Otto. And next is the team size, which is also also in Axie's team. And the team has less process loss and also uses less time to coordinate roles and resolve differences, such as the two, uh, uh, in the three of them, the roles are defined clearly, where Axie uh, pretends as author to infiltrate Valentine's base. Merlin controls the computer and the airplane, as well as Roxy that uh, floats into the space to blow up one of uh, Valentine's satellite. And the, the team also uses less time to develop as uh, they need to stop the Valentine's plan immediately. So as they have the small team size, they also have a more team engagement and responsibility, and also more responsible for the team's uh, success as if they fail, then the human will face an extinction. extinction. Next, for the best task of team, the complex task is divided into the specialized roles as mentioned previously, and where the three of them is divided into specialized specialized roles, such as uh, actually infiltrating the base to get um to get a uh, Merlin online, uh, Merlin controlling the computers, as well as Roxy uh Roxy blowing up one of the satellite. And since their tasks are well structured, then it's easier to coordinate co coordinate, and their tasks also have a high inter dependence reciprocal level as Merlin and Exe and Roxy relies on Merlin to give them instruction and Merlin relies on Exe to provide uh, to get him online in Valentine's network as well as um, Merlin and Exe relies on Roxy to blow up one of Valentine's satellite and due to this they have a better communication and coordination in the team. So lastly is the knowledge based trust. Uh, they Exe, Roxy and Merlin have knowledge on each other's behavior based on past experience on the Kingsman selection training, and therefore they have a confidence on each other's competence, which results in a more stable team. Now I'm going to talk about the organization process in organizations. The first much reason for the first much reason for the organization process in organization is the plot where Harry introduced XC to the Kingsman organization. In this plot, Harry invites XC to the Kingsman terror shop after knowing that he can trust him as in a previous scene. After a ride at the Kingsman Terror uh, show as shown in the screen, Harry asks if Exit is interested in becoming a Kingsman agent. Exit agree and Harry enable the evaluator to uh, biometric authentication, then told Exit about Kingsman history and show him the Kingsman headquarters, which is leave for the Terror show using a hyperloop as shown on the screen. When they arrive at the Kingsman headquarters, Harry also showed Exit around before sending Exit into the uh, Kingsman selection training. The Kingsman organization in the movie is a top secret independent intelligence and uh, as Espionage agency that is based in the United Kingdom, UK, and is dedicated to the uh, unholding peace as well as protecting the world from terrorists and other major tricks. However, in the public eyes, Kingsman is simply just a highly respect uh, class classical chain of the terrorist sort. Next, one of the elements of the organization culture is uh, physical structure. In the movie, the Kingsman organization has their physical structure. This structure reflects the culture of Kingsman that is full of history, such as Terror Shop in this block and as the image. The Terror Shop in the movie looks like a tropical Terror Shop, but the Terror Shop is one of the secret base of Kingsman organization. Inside the Terror Shop, uh, there has a secret environmental with biometric authentication, and the environmental can bring Kingsman agents to the secret underground base. Moreover, the Terror Shop also has some secret rooms with different usage, such as a meeting room, and secret rooms that provide many equipment of, uh, and weapons. Moreover, the movie also shows that the Kingsman organization also has many shops that look like Regic and normal shop. For example, in the movie scene, we are for XC suggestion to buy a head from the shop. But the shop is under the Kingsman organization and the hex will install a tracker for track its location. Next, language is important in an organization because employees or people in the organization address each other and outsider uh, aspect emotion and describe the uh, stakeholder with language. In the movie, the Kingsman agents call each other with a secret agent code. Uh, which, which is represented by the knight of the round table to protect their area in the identity such as the agent court or Harry is Galahad and the agent court can be inherited. 
Furthermore, the Queen's Maid agents such as Harry Hart already use the proper gentlemanly language to express their idea and emotion. For example, Harry Hart is provoked by gangster in bar, but he expects his uh, emotion and idea uh, politely to ask them to wait for him to finish his beer first. So next is the rituals and ceremonies for the uh, organizational culture. So for the Kingsman organization, they have a ritual which is to drink a toast after losing an agent as shown in the right, uh, where they drink a toast after losing, losing agent and slot at the beginning of the movie. Uh, however, uh, in, a, a, in a future part of the movie where uh, Harry dies, which is Agent Galahad, he also drinks a toast. And in this scene, Arthur makes an exception, makes an exception to toast with Pat to toast with Axie, as uh, Harry was very fond of Axie previously. And they also have another uh, ritual, which is to carry out the King's Men selection training whenever uh, the agent, one of the agent dies to select the replacement for the agent. And in this scene, it's shown that the King's Men selection training is carried out to select the next agent to replace the agent and slot. And lastly, for the organizational culture of stories and legend, it is described uh, it, it describes real people, which is shown by the uh, founders of the Kingsman organization during a scene in one of the movies. And it's all, it is also known throughout the organization and assumed to be true by the members, such as uh, Arthur, Harry, and Axie. And the stories and legends are also prescriptive, which is shown in the scene where uh, Harry told Axie about the stories and legends of the Kingsman organization. Next, I'm going to pass to Jim Hong to talk about the second plot of the organization processes. Uh, on the other hand, the second plot chosen for the organizational process in organization is the plot where Valentine plans to carry out his master plan, which is to perform a massive killing that will cause the extinction of humans and start over in a new world. So uh, Valentine has his own company named Valentine Corporation, which is known for providing new technology to many markets around the world, primarily in the communication industry. So Valentine then utilizes his company to carry out his plan by giving away SIM cards that can provide unlimited calls and internet on his network which is not delighted and accepted by the world population. However, the SIM cards can also transmit a neurological wave that triggers aggression and switches off inhibitors in a person's brain, which makes the person become violent and resort to killing. Besides, uh, Valentine also invited or persuaded rich and powerful individuals to join in his master plan and implanted each of them with a chip that will make them immune to the neurological waves and survive the killing. So this picture shows that the Swedish Prime Minister accept Valentine's plan to implant a chip inside his neck so that he won't be affected when Valentine activated the system. Uh, in this plot, Richmond Valentine shows that he is a change agent who possesses the knowledge and power to guide and facilitate the change effort to save this planet because it is facing environmental issues such as global warming. So as a wealthy technology tycoon and a computer genius, Valentine uses his knowledge about technology to make the SIM card that can make people extremely violent and kill among themselves to solve the overpopulation problem. Besides, uh, what Valentine proposed in his plan involves transformational leadership because that he wants the planet only left with very few people who have social status and wealth in order to save the planet that was overpopulation. This is because when Valentine activates the SIM cards, there will be no more government. So this is a transformational change and he is the leader for all those people who survive. Furthermore, Valentine also provides a sense of direction when he tries to persuade the people to accept his plan and he tells Arthur that when you get a virus, you get a fever. That's the human body raising its core temperature to kill the virus. Planet Earth works the same way. Uh, global warming is the fever. Mankind is the virus. We are making our planet sick. A car is our only hope. So if we don't reduce our population ourselves, there are only two, one of two ways this can go. The host kills the virus or the virus kills the host. Either way. So Arthur tells Exe that he understood once Valentine explains, to, explains it to him. Uh, after that, uh, next, uh, Diffusion of change is also shown in this movie where Valentine shows his motivation in the scene that he motivates people to join his new world that supported his ideas, including Professor Hems Arnold, the Swedish Prime Minister Morten Lindstrom, and Chester King, as known as Arthur, the treacherous tre leader of the independence by organization Kingsman. Moreover, Valentine also shows his ability when he trains his employee Gazelle to adopt and help with his plan. Gazelle is responsible to take care of the progress of, for the SIM card and she is always update Valentine's on the latest progress. Furthermore, Valentine also shows his role perception as a leader when he knows that Harry Hart already knows something after he meets Professor Arnold. Valentine as a leader tells Gazelle to bring the product release for the SIM cards forward so that their plan can run smooth, smoothly although it will cause a fortune. And finally, the situational factor is also shown by Valentine. Due to time constraints, Valentine brings the time 
for a product released forward, although it will cost a fortune. Valentine produced the SIM cards in the big factory because he scares that Harry Hart and the Kingsman organization will ruin his plan. So he produced the SIM cards quicker. So uh, in conclusion, first of all, uh, for the first character, which is Gary X. Alvin or X. It shows that he's a team player and he's dedicated in contributing to his team, such as uh, when his team of uh, X. Merlin and Roxy, he he performs, he carry on and completes his task, which is to uh, let Merlin into the Valentine's network. And then even when he was, uh, when, when his identity was blown by Chuck, Charlie and he ran ran out of the base. After that, Merlin told him he need to go back again to stop uh Valentine from touching the table as the system is has the biometric security and he cannot shut it from there. And Axie being a team player, he went back in and fight with uh Gazelle in order to stop in order to stop Valentine Valentine's master plan. And being a team player, Axie also believes and trusts in his team members, such as uh his trust in Roxy is able to blow up one of Valentine's uh, satellite. Next, I'm passing to Nijing to talk about uh, Harry Hart. In my opinion, the key success of Harry Hart is that he is always maintaining some control, which is shown in the blog, where Harry and Axie have a conversation in the bar after their first encounter outside of the police station. Even Axie speaks loudly and rudely with Harry, but Harry maintains some control and still continues to have a conversation with Axie, even as he disrespects him. Lastly, we can see that the Harry doing well in the control himself, even uh, provoked by Gamester. So now I'm going to pass to Xing Hong to talk about the conclusion about Valentine. So in conclusion, the key success factor for Richmond Valentine is the team cohesion for Valentine and his personal assistant, Gazelle. High team cohesion can show because Valentine has a higher member similarity with Gazelle and he is the only person who regularly interacting with Gazelle. So Gazelle agrees with what Valentine do and she does not stop Valentine from doing that. After that, higher team success in team cohesion can also be shown in the plot when XZ go into Valentine's place successfully. Valentine and Gazelle work as a team where Valentine continue to activate the system while Gazelle tries to stop XZ by jumping down from the window and fighting with XZ using the blend, the blood on her lower legs. Valentine is then able to activate his system successfully when Gazelle is trying to stop XZ. Uh, next. So that's all for our team's presentation. Thanks for watching.